Hello, welcome to my daily guide with Anto Alamedi. Thy word, Lord, is a lamp unto our feet and a light unto our paths. Let the power in your word continue to be our guide, guard, and our compass this day. In Jesus' name, Amen. We started off on the Joshua series yesterday with the topic faithful minister we are taking part two of that very topic today and so we're talking about the faithfulness of minister joshua in exodus 33 verse 11 when you read from verse 1 you will understand this verse 11 better and it says, And the Lord speak unto Moses face to face, as a man speaketh unto his friend. And he turned again into the camp, but his servant Joshua, the son of Nun, a young man, departed not out of the tabernacle. Now when you read through the old chapter you will see that as every other person worshiped god at their respective tent door when god came in a pillar of cloud to talk to moses joshua was in the tabernacle now when you check that verse 11 again it takes us to the time of adam and eve in the book of Genesis. And the Lord spake unto Moses, As a man speaketh to his friend, Does this ring any bell? You remember in the garden of Eden, When God usually come in the evening, The cool of the day to play with Adam. That was God's intention. And it is still his intention that every work of his hand would be his chief partner, would have a close relationship with him. Does anyone crave more of him? That was Joshua's mission. As a young guy, looking at Uncle Moses as the only sacred one that could see and hear from God, he desired something more than God. Knowing him more. This doesn't come cheaply though. It requires conscious dedication, self-discipline, self-denial of some things we used to enjoy. We will continue on this series again tomorrow by His grace. Let's take a closing prayer for today. Lord Jesus, I desire to be your close friend. I crave to know you more. Help me, Lord, to know you more, to feel you more, to love you more. In the name of Jesus Christ, Amen. God bless you all.